In this video, we will learn how to include maps in Unity different platforms, including web and mobile, for free using Mapbox APIs. Um, so the result will be a, a map appearing on the screen and the user would be able to inter interact with the values of the map, including its center, the zoom values, for example and also the style from say satellite choosing or satellite streets and so on. Mapbox offers a free tier for each product which allow you to use the API for free with a limited request per month. I'll put a, a link in the description to the Mapbox pricing. And you could see as we scroll down, we could see the limited or the limitation per path for each user. And for uh, example, for the static images API, we'll see we have uh, up to 50,000 uh, requests per month. And uh, Mapbox, uh, uh, so by default, you will have a, a pay as you go billing account which will receive a monthly free tier as included in uh, in this table and the uh, map box will send you an email notification the first time a free tier is exceeding during a billing period uh, but if you don't exceed that your using as a developer would be uh, for free to start we need to uh, click on get started and if you don't have an account, you can create an account and sign up. Uh, otherwise, we could uh, just log in. And once we log in uh, to your account, you could see the, the, the free tier request available for each type of API. And so uh, uh, we will need to create a token, access token, if you don't have one. So press create token and then give it a name, um, anything you want. I'll just put it Unity test, for example, and then uh, press on uh, create token. And the new token will be created. Later, we will need this token to, uh, you just need to enter your password uh, to confirm uh, the, uh, uh, th that's, uh, th the, to validate the request. And then a new uh, token will be created. And that token uh, will be needed later to, uh, uh, in Unity to make the ABI request work. So in Unity editor, we need to create raw image. So right click UI uh, raw image, and we're just gonna call it map box and I'll just change the uh, the make sure the pivot is 0.5 on X and Y and the uh, anchor is in the center I'll change the X and Y to 0 and the width and height to 1000 and if I press F well, we could uh, see it over here Okay, next I'll create a script. So under the assets, I'll create a new folder called scripts. And inside this folder, I'll create a C sharp file and we'll call it map box. Once that C sharp file is created, I will uh, drag it into the new uh, game object, which is map box. It's a raw image and click on it to make sure that the script is there and then double click on the script to open it in Visual Studio. The script file contains the following code and the description below contains a GitHub link to the full code that you can download and use. Save the script and go back to Unity Editor. In the editor, I will select Mapbox so we could access to the public variable in the script. And uh, the access token we created earlier inside the Mapbox uh, account, we need to paste it here. And then the other uh, v variables are already here set by default. In my case, I wanted it to, the map to be centered into Sydney. 
so I just put this and put the zoom that I'm happy with and if I click play and I'll just change the aspect to full HD we'll see the map is over here and I could change the uh, zoom as soon as I change it the map would update because of our code and we could also change the style and uh, to satellite or uh, satellite street or any other value or you could play around with these values as well thank you please like subscribe and click the notifications button to help me make more videos like this